This is the Fontana Village Resort. This is the lodge. A uh, really awesome place. There's a lot of history. And I'll take you on a quick little tour of the commons ground. It's raining outside. So I've uh, I've elected to take another zero here. Get caught up on all my videos and editing. Get them uploaded because pretty good Wi-Fi. That last picture was the uh, Mountain View Bistro. Had a had a cheeseburger there last night called the Dam Burger because you know the Fontana Dam. Um, they offer a little computer here that you can print out your Smoky Mountains backcountry permit. This place is basically its own little town. You can't see it. It goes downhill from there and stretches out that way. Um, they have 13, like uh, a population of 13 people that live here. And uh, the the waitress last night that brought us our our cheeseburgers is is the mayor uh, right now of Fontana Village. This would be really nice if they crank up that fireplace. And, of course, it's pretty empty right now because, you know, it's not the hiker season. It's not summertime. The things you can pick up here and pay for <clears throat> on the other side of the lobby. looking at the fish be like food <laughs> new town of Fontana Dam springs up in the middle of nowhere oh the uh, the general store is not open yet here at the village probably won't open until sometime in March but the pit stop gas station has about everything you need for a resupply and that's what we'll be walking across tomorrow to get to the Smokies But really nice place, really clean place. Good Wi Fi. Okay, I just want to take another moment and uh, thank one of my subscribers, PM, for sending me a letter to Fontana Village. Um, this was the back of the envelope. Target Katahdin. Every step you take is a step closer to Maine. 
and throw a little note. It says, Jonathan, you are rocking the trail. I will be starting my next section hike on the AT in, in Georgia, which I believe you said it was the 100 mile stretch from Springer to uh, Albert Mountain. Enjoy the view on top of Albert. Georgia, my grandmother's first name. As I mentioned, I section hiked Katahdin, Maine, 100 mile wilderness, August 16th. It was awesome, amazing, incredible, and I can't wait to complete the whole thing like you're doing now. Enjoy. God bless you and keep you safe. Hope is my trail name. Uh, glory to God. Hope of Walker, or uh, or that's your real name. Uh, get a good night's sleep at a nice place, or uh, a meal while in town on a zero. And uh, that was the note. Thank you very much. That was unexpected. Hey, I need your card trade. They need to. Kick in your eye. It's a blind field. Been blind the whole line. Puts it, and I can't see in color, but they can see gray. So they can see all the images. The computer basically tells your brain what you're saying. So it puts out a pyramid of three, and you know, it's, oh. it's not perfect, but it, it allows, allows you to, to walk, walk around. around. And so people that have been blind their whole life are like, oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Oh, wow. We're at the pit stop in Fontana Village. This is pretty much a resupply option. Some medicine there. Candy bars, meats, peanuts, bars, jerky. cream so day 22 on the Appalachian Trail uh, took a zero at Fontana Village the lodge and uh, just relaxing sitting on the, the balcony looking out at that Something I've been thinking about the last couple of days. Uh, I saw some of y'all's comments, and uh, someone had said I was encouraging people to carry too much on the trail. Like, I'm not. You know, hike your own hike and do what you can do. Yeah, you know, that old saying in the commercial there's no wrong way to eat a Reese's well there's no wrong way to hike the Appalachian Trail if you want to go ultra light and run it in a month and a half do it if you want to you know carry 20 pounds of food with you so you don't have to go into town every time and spend money staying at hotels or hostels and just want to live in the woods, survivalist, do it. If you want to go into town every chance you get so that you can upload your videos, do it. There's no wrong way to hike the Appalachian Trail. There's cheaper, expensive, faster, slower, easier, hard, 
but it's, it's not a wrong way. I mean, so that being said, you know, it's just hike your own hike. And I'm hiking my own hike. Doesn't make it the wrong way. You know, after uh, after three weeks on the trail, starting in early February, I thought I was going to have a lot of alone time, and you know, not be with uh, hikers. But uh, met met a lot of people. Met a lot of people. Trey, Greg. No trail named Mike, that we now call Tank. Logan and Morgan, their dog Numa, Steve. More recently, you know, onward, Tigger, English detective. People in town, you know, Sly at the, at the budget inn. And Franklin, Spoon Man, which you know gave me a ride into Franklin, and I saw him later in the mountains. The very next day, you know, I'm, I'm just meeting and meeting a lot of people. More than I, more than I thought I would meet starting this early. Uh, the weekend hikers coming out. The people that are completing their southbound through hikes from last year that had to to come out because of the fires they're now doing it like hiccup and it's, it's just uh, you meet a lot of people on the trail so I'm I'm not in the hiker bubble that happens, you know, once the hiker season does get going. Um, you know that that's coming. It hasn't started yet, but it, it'll be it'll be coming behind us. You know, best wishes to all those. You know, if, if some of the fast ones get up to where I'm at, you know, they'll just I'll, I'll say hi as they you know run on by. But I think. The pace I'm keeping, and the, and the time frame that I'm looking at, I'll, I'll stay ahead of the major hiking crowd. Which you know has its perks and its disadvantages. You know, a lot of a lot of places aren't open yet because it's not the hiker season. You know, like the the general store at NOC, the general store here at Fontana Village. You know, you gotta you gotta resupply where you can. Sometimes that's a little bit more expensive. But yeah. You know, so just like there's no wrong way to eat a Reese's. I mean, unless you try like shove it in your ear, maybe. Uh, there's there's really no wrong way to to through hike and. AT. But that'll probably be it for day 22. I'll go ahead and edit it together and get it uploaded here um, at Fontana Village where there's, there's there is good Wi-Fi here. Granted, there's probably only about eight people here, <laughs> but you know it's it's good Wi-Fi right now. We got three or four days through the Smokies before I get off to uh, to go take a day uh, out of Gatlinburg. So I'll be able to get those uh, first first few days of the Smokies uploaded in Knoxville at my buddy's house and, uh, 
next month will come around pretty soon so my phone will have its uh, fast speed again and I'll be able to get at least a couple weeks worth of videos uploaded before they throttle me back but it's just a uh, it's just kind of been rainy a little drizzly today I mean it's not not raining I'm just drizzling on and off Having a wonderful time though.